Isn't it convenient we're the same thing? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Go out and get some Mimolet. <laughs> it's bright red, just like I said. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Poetry of cholesterol. I mean, cholesterol even sounds like a kind of, you know, like one of those Greek poets that <laughs> threw themselves into a mirror pit or something. You know, it's got that mythical end to it. That's what my doctor says. Okay, here we go. So this starts, I've said this before, uh, but probably not in this room. This starts like um, Eight Miles High by the birds, but it's not. I'm sorry. It's <laughs> Well, when people apologise in public, it's usually phony anyway, it's like humble bragging. <laughs> oh, you know, I wrote this, like, you know, it's not nearly as good as something brilliant, and it's not. But I mean, if something I said it was. <laughs> Plus, it only, I, only took me to write this, eight miles high, took three people, one of them was dead, one of them was David Crosby. <laughs> Touché. <laughs> Here we go. Someone requested, uh, someone in this room requested it, apparently, or someone who thought, said they were going to be in this room. So. And, uh, you know, after a while, your skin gets kind of very rubbery and white, like an axolotl, and you can feel your fingers flickering. And you think, well, if, if my fingers flicker, am I just going to spend my time on a rock, possibly, you know, seven feet under the water, with my tongue flickering, trying to get, get at mollusks? Is it... I get at mollusks, do I have a, a problem with them, or actually I can't live without them? And it's the same with cheese, but you will not get much cheese on the seabed. <laughs> Rock, foot and creer and slippery breeze. Cheddar in a 